Welcome to K1 World Grand Prix. This is 2021 Japan Yokohama Matsuri at the Yokohama Arena. I'm Russell Guru and I have with me Nicholas Pettis. This is a super fight uh, of the K1 featherweight between Kaito Ozawa and Ruta Kumiela. Oh, I like Kaito Ozawa. Yep. Yep. He's a really cool, calm, collected fighter. He's really smart. Like, just, you know, beautiful way of style and rhythm and like technique. It's, it's always a pleasure to watch him fight. Also, uh, as the second uh, crush champion as well. So, uh, <gasps> they are the featherweight super fight. Let's see what happens in round one. Lee. Starts off good. South Paul versus Orthodox Fighter here. Three. Mm. Nice kick. Both on the same age, kind of similar fighting records. Uh, Ozawa has had 14 wins and seven KOs, so that's that's pretty neat. With uh, ten, whereas Kuni had a 10 wins and five KOs. Oh, and a down. They're kind of just sussing each other out at yeah. this point here. I mean, they're spending a lot of time just like you know thinking about the timing, the distance, and what to start, what not to start. So they're being a little bit cautious here. Um, this is probably going to evolve into a good fight a little bit longer on. And I'm thinking, oh, there you go. <laughs> As I said that, they go for it. <laughs> I mean, Kaito is our style, you know, it's like he's really paying attention to his opponent. Yep. And when he does hit, he tries to hit hard. Mm. Good. Nice kick there. He takes advantage of that south ball very well. Nice. Oh, sneaky. Overhand <laughs> there. I like it. That actually connected the first one. There you go. Yeah, and, it, and it's this round one is going like really fast. It's funny to see how the fans are like cheering them on with those like balloons <laughs> they're having there. I didn't know they had them in kickboxing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen it in uh, you know baseball and stuff like that. Mm. Whoa, what a big hey. man! He almost connected with that. Break and a couple of seconds more left in this round one. There we go. That's that was a good first round, actually. Yeah. I enjoyed that. Ozawa and uh, Kunieda. Very Kaito Ozawa style. Mm. And uh, uh, but uh, first round, would you give to whom? Mm. I think that would be like a 10-10. Mm -hmm. Let's say that was a draw. Yeah. Yeah, so Kunieda actually, in his spare time, or he, he actually runs a construction company as well, too. Oh, really? Yeah. Wow. <laughs> as well as fighting someone like Kaito Zawa. I mean, how many hats have he had? Like, That's pretty impressive. Yeah. <laughs> right? At 28. Well, guy. in case he loses, he's got something to fall back on. <laughs> <laughs> that, that, too. That, too. Yeah. So Kunieda getting some advice from his... Yeah, I think it's uh, generally like a underrated that you can actually have a, a, a real job and also be a professional fighter. People yeah. often think that they have to just train. Mm. But if you train smart enough and you have enough you know, talent for it, yeah. you can totally have a normal job on the side. There you go. Into round two and some fast movie from Ozawa.
Exchange. Oh, that actually connected. Good. Hey. When it happens, it happens in the spots, these guys are. <laughs> oh, but Yuta's doing really well, actually, yep. in this round. Yep. <laughs> yeah, at least, yeah. like put a jab yeah, on or like, yeah. Wee. I like how Yuta did not get like sucker punched into it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, right, right. You, you didn't fall for it. Yeah. We've got another minute left of this round here. So. Mm -hmm. Ah, good kick again. Wee. <laughs> oh, was it? Yeah. There. Yeah. Oui. Nice. Hey. Oh, nice kick. Oh, almost at him. Almost. Not quite hard. Ten seconds go. Round two. Oh man, that kick. That last kick? Yeah. Ay, ay, ay. <laughs> it could have worked like it. I was just about to say that sometimes, you know, mm. when, when they get into that rhythm of, of like of like like calculating what right. they're about to do. Right. That anything can happen, like mm. but it, it happens so fast sometimes. Yeah. <laughs> that was a good round actually. Yeah. I think they're both going to be a bit more aggressive in the third round. Yeah. But yeah, great middle kicks from Kaito. Like, ooh, Woo. yeah, that one. Almost. Still on top of it, they don't seem to have much fatigue. Oh. Yeah. And uh, to go back into the ring in the third round of this K1 featherweight super fight. Yeah, they did take the lead there. Just to stretch it out. <laughs> uh, we kind of had to pull them back a little. Getting frustrated there a little bit. All right, let's close the distance. Let's Ooh. get it done. This is what he's been doing for two rounds now. Yeah. Same pattern, he comes in, he, hugs, he ties him up. You know, you gotta let the hands do the talking here in this round. We. We. Good, so every time he's like yep. almost there, you know, Kaito's like keeping him at, at bay with a front kick or a middle kick or something, you know, so he never really gets going. 
Yeah. He's only got two nah, more minutes if he really wants to take advantage of this fight. He has to really fight for it. Rosal's not letting him touch him. Huh? I wonder what's going through their minds right now. It's like, okay, you see? He can't get started because every yeah. time he does, he gets like, there you go. This is what you got to do. Exactly yeah. that. Come on. Oh, action, people. Yeah. <laughs> Not quite. Okay. Let's kickbox. Oh, they headbutting each other? That's what he's complaining, complaining about? Yeah, there's a bit of a... Someone can get a caution for this caution for this, yeah. I wonder what he's saying. Listen up. Stop tying him up or something. Hmm. Yeah, something about the head. The hair. So. Uh, yeah, that was a headbutt. Yeah. Well, here we go. We've got one minute left, and it's going to be intense. Same thing, same thing as before. Whoa, come on. Out of it. I'm into it. Yeah. Contact. Ooh. Yeah, yes, yes, yes. There you go. Yuta's finally putting proper pressure on him. <laughs> okay, and it's, it's a third round, so now never. Yeah. yeah, 30 seconds to go. Ooh. Ah, that didn't quite work. Hmm. <laughs> we yes. But is it enough? No. Is no. it enough to win? <laughs> That's my question. Ah. It's kind of frustrating for <laughs> all of us. Oui. Yeah, yeah. No, that was not a down. We. Oui. <laughs> That's it. Three rounds. In this K1. I don't know, man. Uh, I'd probably go with like an extra round, just because it was pretty even. Ah. So you, especially that last, uh, the third round, huh? I would like to have seen, you know, a little bit more work well, from Kaito, like just more, uh, yeah, sure. more punches, and more, you know, combinations. I felt like he was like outboxing him a little bit too much. Oh, 30 29. Oh, goes to Ozawa. Another 39. 30 to 29. Goes to Ozawa. And here we have it. Uh, yeah, we're now there is uh, Kaito Ozawa for this K1 Federal Super Fight. So yeah, a little more action might have been nice, but uh, there we have it. Uh, this is by uh, win by decision there. What would you, what would you have liked to have seen, uh, Nick, in that fight? I don't know. I mean, it was a technical, uh, you know, difficult fight for both of them, and because of the southpaw versus the orthodox, it's yeah. just like you know, hard to really get um, Yuta Kuniyeda to get in mm -hmm. and get his techniques like unleashed, you know. Um, but yeah. Kaito's our fight like Kaito's our always does. So, um, yeah, I think he did and accomplished what he uh, set out to do. Sure. Yeah, I think they really enjoyed the first round at the beginning. That was very cool. Look at there, there is uh, his trophy. <laughs> Like someone who's a fan of it as well. Oh, there it is, uh, folks. Thank you all for uh, watching. Uh, this was the K1 World Grand Prix 2021 Yokohama Matsuri at the Yokohama Arena. Uh, there was Kaito Ozawa. I'm Russell Guru. And I am Nicholas Pettis.